It's the kind of beat to go. Hey guys, what's up? It's Joey, and today we're here for the Survivors Let's Play. But first off, today's pretty much exciting. It's a pretty exciting day. Now, we've had a lot of pretty big things that dropped today. First, Apple had their little press event today. They uh, released the iPhone 6. They, well, they announced it at least. It looks phenomenal. We got the iPhone 6, iPhone 6 Plus. iPhone 6 Plus is like giant 5.5 inch uh, new processors. Everything is looking real fancy, and I like it. Dogs barking. I'm praying that is a disturbance, something that I really want, because that might be the second thing that dropped today. Destiny, I ordered that, and I really was looking forward to play it, and I'm really, I've been waiting all day for it to come. It still hasn't come, and I'm hoping that the doorbell will ring in a minute, but it could just be the dog reacting to some random sound. I don't even know. But anyways, Destiny, iPhone, iWatch even, that's pretty sick. But anyway, probably the most important thing that was released today, well, announced, Proletariat made it on the keynote, the Apple keynote. They were, they had a spot right there. Shout out to Proletariat. They made this, they made all the games. They made part of the gaming keynote, and it was so sick. I was like in, I was in history class just watching the keynote because I was bored. I saw it. I was like ecstatic. I was like, what? I was shocked. I'm going to be honest. I had no idea that was coming. But it was sick. I loved it. But right now, we're playing their game, World Domination. I'm excited to play. So let's just get to it. This is going to be like a fun little let's play, kind of throwing it back and getting back to our roots, just kind of playing through, doing some fun stuff. And with that being said, I think we should be throwing it back to good old San Francisco on expert with this solid loadout right here. Let's get to it. Mexico City, El Mundo, Esta Muerto. No doorbell. Bummer. All right, so what we got going, it's pretty simple here. Now, right here, I'm just going to throw two fire chiefs, two medics, and then I'm going to put a machine gunner. Okay, I guess I can't put a machine gunner. What did I put? I put too many fire chiefs. That was a bummer. All right, we're going to put a machine gunner over here anyway. And right over here, machine gunner, of course. And uh, I'm going to put a fire chief just in case. We get in a bit of a predicament. But other than that, I'm feeling pretty good. San Francisco is always fun. It's kind of one of those first little things that you always dealt with when you first start the game. It's exciting. It's fun. But with machine gunners, they just tear everything apart. And I'm a fan, personally. I think that's pretty amazing. So, guys are pretty much just ripping things apart. And I, guys, I have to, I can't stress this enough. I'm so pumped for this next update. World's Domination 2.0. Such gonna, it's gonna be so sick. I'm so pumped because I'm ready to like replay the campaign or something on some crazy hard level. I don't even know. It's gonna be sick. Uh, we're just rolling. Got some sprayers coming out, but with these machine gunners, the way I place them, they have the protection of the fire chiefs and the medics, so they're pretty much just tearing everything up. We're on the final wave, so I'm gonna throw a Molotov cocktail right back here. Boom! Took out all the drones. We have one drone left. What will he go down? Boom! Boom! Knocked down, no chance at all. All right, so that's San Francisco. And the next one you usually face is New Orleans, I believe. So you know what? We're just going to check out New Orleans on Expert. I'm just going to close my eyes and pick random people. Huh, interesting. I'll take it. Not too shabby. I think that's a pretty solid loadout for just randomly closing my eyes and picking stuff. I like it. All right, let's defend it on expert. Load it out, boy. New Orleans. It ain't easy being big. All right, so hospitals on the far corner over here. We have plenty of space, plenty of straightaways, which is perfect for machine gunners. So I'm going to throw my machine gunner right here in the back. He's just going to be chilling over here by the hospital. Uh, right over here, I'm going to put a uh, you know, solid group right over here. Uh, let's set up some, we don't even have any snipers, so I'm going to put a group of mercs right over here. They're going to be in a little tough situation, but we're going to do our best with what we got. I'm going to move these guys as far back as possible. I'm going to throw all my commandos here. Let's put a solid outlaw chill group back here. And let's put my last mercenary and an EM, no, gunfighter, gunslinger. Start waves. Let's see what we can do, what we can do with this. All right, so 
Drones are pretty much being locked down by these mercs on the far end over here. They can't even do anything. They can barely get off their like little, they can barely just get out of the gate. So we've got some runners. They're getting close, but they're not getting close enough. They just can't do it. All right, so we're just rolling here with no problems at all. Drones just being locked down. Mercenaries level 20, definitely upgrade them if you can. They're very good. Very, just amazing leveled up. I'm a big fan. I love them. So, Merc's going down. Runners, well, Merc's are still not alive. We're still full throttle. Boom. We knocked it out. Clutch. All right. So, let's collect those guys. And let's just finish out wiping out the U.S. of A. Huh. Vancouver. It's not, it's in Canada, but still. I think it counts. So, let's defend it. I'm going to take out this, this, and that. I'm just rolling with, okay, I can't roll with that. I want snipers then. Bitta. Boom. And boom. Select. Change. Outlaw. Accept. Defend. We're off. And we are rolling. So, reach the indeterminate terminal city, whatever. Vancouver. I'm a fan, I'm a fan, I'm a fan. Hospital's way back there, then we got the hospital right here. Everything's kind of close quarters from here, but not too close. I'm actually really liking this little setup we have here. So right here, this group is not even going to get a chance to like get past me at all, just because it's so locked down. we got the outlaws for the brutes, mercenaries for the drones and runners and everything like that. It's pretty much locked down. No one's going to be able to get past this. Over here is a similar story. They're not going to be able to do much. So we're just going to put all snipers back here and see what they can do. Eh, plus an outlaw, just because. So that's what we have set up right over here. And then we're just going to kind of see how they can handle it for the longest time. And I'm pretty sure they're going to start getting a little bit low on stuff. They're probably going to end up dying. But so far, so good. Wow. Tire first wave locked down by all snipers. Ooh, what happened to my hair? I love it. All right, let's just keep stemming these guys up and just keep getting some lockdown D. Let's use a flare to kind of send them back a little bit, give the snipers a little bit extra time to wipe them out. Boom, 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 boom. Come on, get those last few guys out of the way. All right, so I'm going to get prepared. Whoa, we might not even have to do anything. All right, so once these guys group up a little bit, actually, wow. I didn't have to use any troops over here because this guy's, these guys are locking it down. I knew they would. So over here, they're just getting in range right over here perfectly for my snipers to just pick them off one by one. Looks like we're going to have them taken out pretty quickly. So it's good. got a few more drones left. One. Boom. It's cake. I love it. So that's three stars. We cleared it. I love it. Got a lumberjack. Money. And... Let's uh, send in a little bunker here. Now, one thing that I really enjoy about bunkers is that I can just send my little lower epic troops and they'll get me a ton of cans. So if I just send in my one guy, I'm going to boost it up to 99. Let's see if we got another one that can show y'all what I uh, do. Okay, we already did it. Where's the other one? I know there's another one somewhere. There it is. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to send all my epic troops. Since they're low level, eh, it's not as good. But they're still epic, so they're going to get me a lot more than my level 1 standard troops. My normal guys. So we send all them. We're up to 427 cans. That's really good. That's amazing. I love it. So that's pretty much just about it for this episode, guys. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. See you guys.